Hey guys, Bubble Pop Kids here. Get ready. You know what time it is. Squishy chopping time. Bubble, squishy chopping time with like zombie. Squishy chopping time with like strawberry. I like your song. Hi, Bubble Teens. We are doing this. Another squishy chopping show. You know that's what I love best. I love my squishies. We got so many cute ones. So many weird ones, actually. Look at this. Electro putty. Oh, it says wham oh What is wham -o? What is electric putty? What does that mean? Is this like magic? Who is he? Saw this at the store today. I just couldn't believe it. It comes with like a little pen, a little laser pen. I don't know what is going on. It bounces. It lights up. You can even write on it. And when I look at this, I don't know. It kind of looks like the moon. <laughs> it's so, so weird. Cannot wait to look at that thing. Oh, it looks like the moon, because it is the moon. Or like maybe it's a piece of Swiss cheese. So odd. Here we got that one. We got two Colleen homemades. Actually, she made me. Oh, so cute. I just realized this little delish donut, a little Shopkins party balloon. And this thing is so weird. I felt it a little earlier. It's got little bumps. It's oh, this homemade squishy with like delish donut. It's kind of shaped like a jelly bean. It looks like a jelly bunny. So cute. Actually, little mistake. She actually made me three homies. I got this one. I got the zombie. And look at this. The other day, she made strawberry jam. We got Smucka's Concord Grape. She made slime. Wow, it looks just like the real deal. So cool. Oh, you know what you're going to do with this Smucka's Concord Grape Jam? You are going to get a butter knife and like spread it on this squishy bread. On this good morning bread, actually. Last time I had one of Colleen's jammy slimes that looks like jelly. I spread it out on like a piece of squishy bread. I got another piece of squishy bread, but it's so cute. It's got kind of a pinkish color. I think it's scented. What's with the cow? Ah, squishy bread! Oh, the cow is on there because like the pink is supposed to be pink yogurt spread from a cow yogurt. It's called Good Morning Bread. Get it right! also have a jambé. Colleen didn't make this, but she definitely put something in here. Ew, look at that. Oh, when you chop this thing open, you are definitely, definitely wearing gloves, because like it's gonna ruin your fingers, for sure. One eye is spinning, his head and brain is leaking blood, and this eye is popping out. He's got a Frankenstein mouth. That's so weird. And you find a little squisharoo up on the chopper today. We got this one. At first I thought it was a tomato, but now I'm looking at it with those little dimples. A strawberry. A strawberry splat. Well, do that again. Look at that. That's unbelievable. Stick to your table. Got a sweet pass. We are done with the intro. We see everything here. Let's start chopping it up. I got my shishies. And if you're ever going to do this at home, just make sure you have an adult or parent supervising. We don't know what's in these things. And the scissors are super sharp. Come on. Let's do it. I don't know if you knew this or not, but I would like to start with the electrical putty or the electro putty because it's so cool. Open it. First up, we got the electric putty to look at. Oh, this is so, so cool. I think I found it at Michael's, the craft store. Maybe it was like three or four bucks. And I just had to have it. Glow in the dark putty. Ooh, it's glow. And you write on it. Just so many things going on with it. Check it out. There are so many things going on with it, like brilliant dance stretches. That's so weird. Let me open it with your shizzies. Here goes. Okay, here we go. Kind of like a weird little case. Wow, it looks like half of a moon or some kind of planet. Ooh. It's a little piece, like a little packet. It's almost clear. And the laser rider. You did not just call this a laser writer. This is an LED pen. An LED pen. Look at that. Get it right. And this is your electro putty. It's glowing in my hand. Galactic. Oh, I charge this in the light for a little bit. This stuff is so, so glowing. I mean, it's not even that dark in here. You can see it. Pop this baby out of here. It feels like, it feels like Laffy Taffy or some kind of gum. I like it. <laughs> it's so weird. It's not like a putty. It's more like 
It feels like a dried up glue or something. Oh, oh, it's losing its charge. It's losing its glow charge. Put it in the light right now. Yeah, much better now. It is lighting up your table. It is nuclear again. Um, this glows. I made the room a little bit darker. This stuff is so, so cool. It is such a teeny tiny piece, but it's all you need. It's kind of like one of those little glow stars you stick on the wall. So stretchy. Look at that. Looks like a ghost. Oh, this thing literally looks like a little ghost flying around. It's like so spooky. I don't like it. So we saw the glow on this baby. Next thing we have to do is get the little writing pen. It writes with lights. I don't know how that's gonna work. And see how this goes. Let's do it. Oh, so easy. Like when you put the pen to the putty, it looks like it's gonna explode or something. Whoa! Hmm, when I tried to write with the pen, I didn't notice much. What's going on here? Watch and learn, Bubble. Here's a light. Make a bee. You see that? Now that I'm looking at it with the lights a little bit more dim, yeah, it is working. That is so, so cool. I don't know how this putty is like holding the color. I did a little zigzag. It's amazing. <laughs> this is the weirdest thing ever. And this little tiny little light is so little. So weird. Bubble, it's not weird. It's not weird. It's like the coolest thing on the planet. We are writing with light. Look at that. So there it is, your little glow teenies. That was a glow electro putty. It sure was electric. I loved it. I wish it was like a little bit of a bigger piece so you could do a little more and stretch it out a little more. But it was really good and it came with this little pen. Perfect. Literally looks like the moon or an outer space planet on your table. Amazing. Hey everybody! It's a Splatball! Strawberry Tomato! Blah! Oh teenies, we are going from electric putty to like Splat Tomato Strawberry. It's a fruit and a veggie combined. How do you like that? Look at it. Sticking to Bubbles' table, it looks like a zombie brain. Yeah. I can squish it up. It is the tomato strawberry. I call it that because it looks a little like both, but I think it's a strawberry. It is so squish. Oh, I could just pop it. Love this thing, and I love how it splats. Look at this. So funny. is so so tough I don't know what kind of rubber this is but it just cannot break so we gotta pop and chop it right now let's do it ah! Ew, bubble, like strawberry tomato liquid Ew. so that strawberry liquid or water whatever was in that splat hit my table some of it is in the little cup here it is, flat as a cookie. I mean flat as a pancake, Bubba. So rad. We are going to chop off the stem. And we are going to flip it inside out and stretch. So nice. Ew, Bubba, I don't like it. Ah! Bubba, guess what? It's party time. It's party time. With Delish Donut! Oh, it's party time! With Delish Donut! Right on your table! Oh boy, we got a Colleen homemade. So soon, this is the third squisher thing. And this little balloon here reminds me of a jelly bean. I don't know why, it's not that round shape. Although you can mold it a little. It's like a jelly belly. Party time! Party time with a balloon that literally looks like infection. Baba, this is infectious. Open it. Bubble, yeah. like when I do this, the little donut gets so big and then she shrinks back to her little donut size. Look at that. It's like magic. Yeah. It's so, so cool. Actually, it looks a little like cookie cookie. I don't know why when I squeeze it. That is so, so weird. Pop it. 
Sorry, Bubba. I'll do the honors with your plaid chichis and pop it for you. Because I'm so nice. Let's do it. Ugh! Infection! Ooh, that doesn't look good. What just popped out of this cute little shopkey balloon? Ooh, it looks like butter. It looks like fungus. Ooh! Uh, I'll tell you what it looks like. It either looks like melted butter, it looks like scrambled raw egg, or it looks like cake batter. I think it's like scrambled raw egg. It stinks! Ah! Hmm, very weird. I don't know why Colleen thought to put this in there. Maybe there's some shopkin tied in inside. I feel something in the middle. This is so weird. It's so, so sticky and gooey. How did she make this? Ooh. What is in here? Mm. Oh, are you serious? She put more of these little plastic surprise bag keychain thingies. She's always putting those in. Okay, so we got like a yellow one. We got like, ooh, it's like red. This is crazy. Looks like it's wrapped in butter. Oh, I seriously cannot even get my hands off of this. I mean, it is like slime, but it's super sticky. I don't think she used the right formula for this one. So we got one, two, hopefully some more, because I think I'm going to like these things. These cute little keychains. Oh, yeah. We got the blue one. Looks like little Stitch. Looks like little Stitch bubble. That is Stitch in a little blue bag on a keychain. So cute. What else are we going to find inside of the scrambled eggs with little white bumpy things? Let's see. I see something here. Ooh. Daisy Duck. Push your teens inside of this big old yellow lumpy mess. Ooh, it's all over my hand. We got four little surprise bags. And from what I could tell, they look like these little Disney keychains. <gasps> so, so cute. I had a Minnie Mouse one the other day. Look at that Pooh Bear. These are like the cutest. I think she got them in Japan. Check those out. Get rid of this devil. So sticky. Oh, I just have to say that like scrambled egg slime is completely wacko. It's wacko. It really is. It looks a little like dipping eggy. It's like egg yolk city here. Ugh. This stuff is like way sticky. It's kind of on my hands, a little bit on my table, but it's got this like crunchy, kind of fluffy feel. I'm starting to like it a little. I don't know why. It's weird. It is weird, Bubble, but like at least if we can poke at it, it's okay. It is okay. It's like, it's like butter. Let me see if it spreads like butter. Oh, yeah. Buttering up your chopping block. Isn't that crazy, Bubble? So crazy. Enough with the scramby egg slime. I can't take it anymore. It is so sticky. We gotta look at our little prizes. Oh, I know these are gonna be so cute. She puts the cutest little things, little tchotchkes in the slime lately. No way. Look at that. No way. No way. It's like a little bag of candy. It says candy. It is red flavor. Mickey Mouse is in there. I think it's like a gummy candy with a little keychain. So beautiful. We got little Mickey and it's so cute because I actually got the mini one. She put that in a little squish the other day. So, so cute. And we got three more. No, I know this is Stitch. Little Stitch. I don't know if this really is Stitch and I'm thinking it is. You're giving it to me because she's my fave. Oh no, it's a little slimy. Scan on. Is this not the cutest little thing you've ever seen? Look at that, it's like a bag. Little Stitch gummy candy. It says blue flavor. Maybe it's like blue razz. Oh, these are the cutest. I don't know where, I, I know she got them in Tokyo Disney. She must have, because I have never seen them in Disney in Florida or California. It's like unreal how cute that is. I think we got Daisy Duck too. Can you believe it? She's one of my faves. Oh yeah, that's Daisy. Each one of these is cuter than the next. Look at this little purple one. It's got Daisy in there. It's just sweet candy. Oh, it's so nice. I think I'm gonna have the whole collection soon. I don't know how many there are. And the last one, from what I can tell, Pooh Bear. Take him out of the slum. We have a winner. Oh, this is the most adorable. Look at this little Pooh Bear. He's got like a little honey pot. And he actually looks like a little gummy. It's like a little gummy bear. 
if you saw my squishy chop and show the other day, I got this little Minnie Mouse one. So now I have five of these little things. They are so, oh, they're just too precious. They look like little candy keychains. Love them. Well, I seriously love Colleen so much because she keeps surprising you with little toys and goodies from like Japan. She is so nice. Loves her. Oh, Bubba, looks like lunchtime with some Schmuckers jam and some bread. Ooh. Ooh, looks like it's snack time. We got to make a jelly sandwich with Colleen's homemade jam. I have not opened this. I don't know what it's like. I know I love the red one, the strawberry one. And I can't wait to see and smell this scented moo cow bread. Oh, it's not moo cow bread. It's not moo cow bread. Get it right. It's good morning bread. Good morning bread. Get it right. Here is your butter knife, so you can properly spread the jam on the good morning bread. Good luck. Here it goes. We're going to open this up. Oh, I cannot wait. It's just got the color is spot on. It looks just like that grape jelly. Whoa. How did she do it, Bubble? How did she do it? How did she get the color? How did she get the texture and the consistency of the Concord jam? Love, Colleen. Ready to pull a little piece out of here. Whoa, it is so, so cool. It actually even like breaks apart like jelly. See if it's scented. Oop, I thought she would have put a little grape scent in there. No, it just smells like glue or some kind of a liquid detergent. But it is still so, so cool. Look at the color. Unbelievable. And it's just so grape stretchy bubble. Look at the stretch on that Concord grape jam. It's like off the chain. Before I go any further with the jelly, I'm going to open up this bread, see what's going on, and put it on there. Make a little sandwich. Oh, Bubba, we can't believe it. I just opened the bag. It smells like grape jelly already. And if you can believe it or not, this big old piece of bread, a toast, is a keychain. It's a keychain. So weird. Wow, this thing is so, so cool. It doesn't look as realistic as the other squishy bread I had that I put that strawberry jam, but it does have the texture. Oh, it feels like a slice of that white bread, and it's got like a pinkish color. It smells like grapes or like fruit, and it's a keychain. <laughs> a little too big for my teeth, but I guess some people would like that. If you got like a big bag, you know I'm going to do it right. I'm going to cut that keychain right off of that bread because it don't belong there. <laughs> oh, this little squishy bread, it ain't too slow rising. It's not too slow rising, but it's going to work. Let me put the jam on it right now. Oh, I think it needs a little more. That's too later. Watch this bubble and learn from the jam master. Oh, this is beyond crazy. This is what you would call a squishy miracle. Like when you make something that is not food look like food. So cool. Everybody, you've got your jelly sandwich right here on some squishy bread. Oh, this looks too real. It's kind of scary. If you put this in the kitchen, somebody would try to eat it. I know. The jelly taco. So cute. Bubble, you know the drill. You know I have to like cut this in half and make a jelly sandwich. Like so. How delicious looking is that? Look when I press on it. All of that oozy gooey grape jelly. So delish. It's pink bread, but it's good. Here it is, sweetie pies. Our little squishy snack. It looks so, so real. Moving along. Okay, Bubba, here's the deal. It is the ninth inning. It is Colleen's zombie. It looks so disgusting and sad. So I bought you some gloves. Use them wisely. And believe it, we are on to the final thing. Oh, so many crazy things in this video. The putty, we have those little candy bags. And now we are going to this zombie man with a Frankenstein mouth. Bubba, zombie man with a Frankenstein mouth. With an I love zombie shirt. Like, what's that about? With an eyeball that's twirling, one that's popping out, and a brain that is bleeding. He is disgusting. Lastly, but like worstly, he is wearing torn pirate shorts. He's like a pirate zombie man. Destroy him. 
<laughs> I'm gonna go with my gut here. I'm gonna put these on because I see this green stuff popping out of here. Oh, it looks so, so gross. Gotta protect my fingers. Don't wanna turn green. Here goes. Yes, I brought you a green bowl that looks like a Reese's peanut butter cup to catch the zombie feelings. Come on, Bubble. Ooh, whatever is brewing inside of this guy. Ooh, I don't like it. I do not want to know. I'm going to do a nice clean little incision on the brain. <laughs> leaking green goo from his zombie brain and neck. Ugh. This is the real deal zombie infection. It's infectious. <laughs> yeah, this thing is so gross, you guys. Oh, first of all, the rubber on this zombie, it feels so, so weird. It's filled. It's this green. <laughs> it's like spinach. It stinks. Mother, here's what I want you to do. I want you to take this and the zombie who's flipped inside out, dispose of it, and never speak of it again. Okay. Green zombie juice literally smells like liver. Smells like liver bubble. So disgusting. There you go, guys. A little more squishy craziness. We got some zombies, some jam, little Disney bags. These were the cutest. Strawberry. Bubble, you forgot to mention scrambled egg and like electric putty. It was electric. And that irresistible grape jelly sandwich. Hope you enjoyed it guys and we're gonna have so many more fun ones coming up on the show if you want to subscribe to our channel just click this big yellow bubble with the bubble gum machine and subscribe have a great day you guys bye